Hi guys, so now we're going to start with the solo, the drum solo. This is not as groovy as the first one, it is e it's easier, I would say. Um, we are going to focus more in the exercise one this week, that is the second time that we have to play it. Because it was not good what you sent, it was not good enough. But uh, with the first solo, um, I think the, the important that was to um, develop the technique of playing the drag close and to uh, coordinate them and to have the swingy groove. I think this was already uh, acquired. Anyway, we're going to go back to it to make it sound perfect, but um, the first objective was already achieved. So, Rhythmania. Let's start uh, reading it. Check here, I play the seventh stop roll. Is it okay? Yes. Yeah. So line one, two, three, four, five. Here I have to switch my hands. Okay, this is already not very good, how I was playing it. Let's focus in the ups and the downs, okay? So I have... The first two bars. If I want to play this in speed, I have to be very accurate with the ups, so this seven stroke roll also. So I have seven, seven stroke roll, then down, tap, up, okay, no. Down, up, 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 down, up, 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 one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. Let's play that faster. Okay. Again. So write the taps, the ups. And when you play this uh, six to plate, it's It's uh, down, tap, 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 up, tap, down. Okay? Okay, so. Let's 
let's repeat these two bars. Now uh, continue reading from the one, two, three, four, five. I mean, you can do how you want. I'm showing you how I am studying it. The important thing is that you see some uh, way for yourself to study it, but that you don't get stuck in it. Okay. Pretty part, yes. One, two, three, four, five. First two bars of the fifth um, line. Sam, left from his right because I'm lefty. Sam, left. Okay. So. why he wrote it with the sticking is clearly easier to play it with another sticking but let's try it like this I mean he wrote it like no there is not the ending okay so switch hands here. Okay, again, five, uh, fifth uh, line. And then again he switches hands. Let's go from the game.
so the reading, uh, my reading skills are a bit uh, out of uh, practice. The sticking, I'm ignoring a bit. Uh, I hope tomorrow it's going to be better. Drag, le uh, drag left, right, left, ah. yeah. and Watch the camera in this movement. having a problem with the fifth and the sixth line. Okay, so let's go for that. Again, fifth and uh, sixth. Okay. 
Okay. Again. from beginning. a bit there but doesn't matter we do it slowly to uh, learn the movements with the hands one more time one two one two <laughs> again there is a switch of accents I want to learn good this last up it would be in the left right uh, le last right hand from the second bar okay I will play first and second bar Just the second bar. Okay, so I want to make this last up. the fifth 
eh, la N. So let's go back to the beginning of the fifth line. Okay. Okay, this is the sixth line. accent in this sextuplet is a full. I need to write this down. So uh, I try to remember it. You can write it down. I will have to write it down um, today or tomorrow. I don't know. But for sure it has to be, you have to remember that this is a full in the sixth line. It's a visual trick. solo. So, um, I'm going to try to play it one last time because of caprice and tomorrow we are going to write down all these ups and downs, okay? You will have to do it as well. so bad. This solo, it's, uh, it was asked for the video audition for Juilliard University. One of the material asked for uh, this audition. So it's a very interesting solo. You can see that you can play it uh, quite good, just reading it a few times. But if you write, when we write the ups, downs, pulls, etc. We are going to be able to play it 
in a tremendous speed and uh, yeah, just push it forward, okay? See you tomorrow.